Well, good afternoon, everyone. I have uh, been doing some investigating on this framing and trying to figure out what's going on with the curbing, and I think I've got it figured out, so I'll give you a shot here. The walls, when they were built, had a band around the outside, and then they stood the wall up on the trailer. Let's see if I can zoom in here. Okay, that right there, on top of that wall stud, is a ha is one inch, and so that's what the edge of the wall was framed with. So there is an inch on top of that one, inch on top of that one, comes on down, and then right here, this right here, had an inch on it. And then that went up and made the curvature of the back. So what I've got to do is I've got to figure out where that's at so I can make sure the framing's all in the right spot. So I've laid this this uh, piece of siding out on that masonite or OSB and I've traced it in there and I've put the window in and I'm going to cut that out and that'll be my template to make sure that everything on the back of this lines up. So that's how we kind of figured that out. Alright, we'll get to cutting this out and then I'll get back with you. There's the curvature of the back. Now what I've got to do is figure there's an inch and a half of framing and then that one inch band. So two and a half inches in is where my framing's got to be. So I'll figure out a way to get that line on there. And then we'll get it all tacked up on the side here and see what we can see. Alright, this is what I come up with to mark this. Just put a little block on there, measured over an inch and a half, put a hole, two and a half inches, put a hole for the pencil, and I should be able to slide that right on around. So, this is how it works, just like that. And that'll keep it nice and straight with the, with the uh, side. over this is the inside because it's going to be too big to stand up inside the trailer and I didn't want to cut the bottom off of the panel to fit it in there. I kind of want it the same size as the outside skin so I'll just mount it to the outside and then I can go on the inside and make sure my framing comes to this 
two and a half inch line. Tape here. See how we did. Inch and a half and two and a half, right on the money. All right, sweet. We'll get that mounted up on the outside, and then I can show you where this siding's off. Or this framing, I should say.